Hi guys, my name is Andrew Fermanzik. Let's help you get Scatter set up fast. Okay, so first thing is go to get-scatter.com. Then you're going to install and launch the Scatter desktop application. Once you get here, you're going to enter in a password that you want to be able to log in and out of Scatter with. So can you know choose something secure that you'll remember. Then click New, Create New Scatter. Once you do that, you're going to be asked to back up your password. So this is a mnemonic phrase, but it doesn't actually back up any of the keys. It's just in case you forget your password. So copy and paste that into a text doc and then save it in a secure location like an encrypted USB or something like that. Then click OK. Then we're going to read the handy dandy terms and conditions and scroll down and read, read, read. OK, we're done. OK, click Accept. Now we are going to set up a backup location for the scatter. So you select your file, and once you've done that, you're into the main scatter window. So you can click Vault, click New. Now we get a new Vault entry key. So this name right here is just for to help you remember what this is for. So just create something that's going to be easy to remember. You can either create a new key or import one. Then you can either use a hardware wallet like a ledger or text. So you can go into text, then you can paste your EOS private key here. And then Scatter is going to do some checking and make sure that it's linked to an EOS account. If it's not, that's a totally different process. So um, yeah, totally different thing. OK, so assuming it's all linked up and good to go, then you go back and we're done. Now you're all set up. So. Um, if you did want to do like a jungle, so we also have this here. So you go to network and you'd confirm your password. So uh, jungle is basically for developers. And so if you wanted to see the developer portal of EOS stack, you can do this. So this is why we're doing this here. So if you wanted to set up the jungle account, first thing you're going to do HTTP. Then we need to put in the chain ID right here. You're going to set the port number to 38,888. Then you're going to put dev.cryptolines.io. And then you're going to name it Jungle Testnet. Then we click the checkbox. And we're done. We got Jungle set up on the testnet. So now we can head on over to members-dev.eostack.io. Then it's going to pop up, waiting for scatter. Then we click Login. We select our key, which is the active one here. And boom, there we go, we're done.